All right, boys and girls, since uh, you're all going to ask for dimensions anyways, um, I'm going to throw that into the footage. All right, I'm going to give the bee's knees here a test drive. It's a little windy. Here's the end-to-end -end wing. 60 inches. Got some flaps. Here we go. Twelve inch ailerons. Uh twelve inch flaps, I'm sorry. Uh twelve inch ailerons. Okay, so she clearly flies. Really well, actually. The elevator is crazy sensitive. And we have 49 inches for the fuselage. Beautiful power into the wind. This is like barely, barely driving this thing at all. Plenty of aileron throws. So we have a 3530 uh, 1400 kV motor and a 70 amp ESC. And uh, the wing tapers. It goes from a uh, 10 inch core down to a six and a half inch core. So that pretty much sums up the bee's knees. She flies like a dream. All right, take two. Here we go. Whoa. Here we go, flight number three. Here we go. Zero throttle, just using the wind to glide. Here's some throttle, gain some speed here so we can make a turn. Here we go, throttle off, keep gliding. Here's some throttle, stabilize it a little bit, prevent the stall. Look at it go! <laughs> oh, I'll be darned, honey. Look at it! She flies like a dream. Oh, shit. Woo! Not bad, huh? It's great! <laughs> you hear that? It's tough with the sun where it is. Yeah. It's alright, you're doing a good job. It's really easy to tell when it's... Upside down? Yes. On purpose, by the way. Wow, honey! It flies as good as the Bixler. It's 
a lot more agile than the big four, actually. Oh, maybe not. That's really tough. Thank you, son. All right, you ready? Yeah. Whoa! <laughs> well done. All right, I'm I'm bringing her in for a landing. Okay. All right, I'm gonna throw on the flaps. Here comes the flaps. This is really gonna slow down. Man, that sun is just de deadly. As you can see, that's Chica guarding the airplane until Alex can get there to pick it up. Teamwork. Watch for snakes. I hear you, Jacob. I hear you. It's gotta be rough being here. 